Hey everyone, welcome to my guide on how to set up and play Metroid Prime 4, Beyond on your PC. Before we get started though, I've gotta remind you of something super important. Make sure you've legally bought the game, that means owning the physical or digital copy. We don't want Nintendo sending Samus after us with a lawsuit, right? Let's keep it all legal, folks. Alright, so to get started, there are four files you'll need to get. Don't worry, it's easier than catching a Pokeball. Just follow these steps and you'll be on your way to playing in no time. Step 1 First, open up your web browser. I know you're already in the zone. Type Eden Emulator into Google and click that first link. It's always the official website. On the website, find the download button, which is like finding a power star in Super Mario. Eden Emulator works on Windows, Mac, Linux, and Android, but we're focusing on Windows today, so click the Windows Download button. Now scroll down to the Assets section and grab the Eden Windows zip file. Once that's done, it's time to install. Step 2. Create a folder called Eden Emulator on your desktop, like you're making a little shrine to gaming glory. Then, open the zip file and drag everything inside into that folder. Once it's all in there, double-click the Eden application file to run the emulator. Boom, you're halfway to playing. Step 3. Now we need something super important, the Nintendo Switch keys and firmware files. But don't panic. If you own a Nintendo Switch and have it set up with custom firmware, you're all good to go. These files will let Eden Emulator talk to your Switch like it's your best friend. And hey, if you're thinking, wait, I don't know how to do that yet, no worries, I've got you covered. Just scan the QR code on the screen with your phone and it'll take you to a page where you can get the keys, firmware, and even the XCI file of Metroid Prime 4, Beyond. Once you've got those three files, just transfer them to your PC using USB or Bluetooth. It's like transferring your Pokemon to the PC, but cooler. Step 4 Next, we'll install those keys and firmware into Eden Emulator. Open Eden, go to the Tools menu, and click Install Firmware from Zip. Find that firmware zip file you downloaded earlier and click Open. Eden will install it like it's putting together a puzzle. Now for the keys, go back to Tools and click Install Decryption Keys. Unzip the keys file and install the product and title keys. If you did everything right, you should now be able to run Switch games on your PC. Step 5. We're almost there. It's time to optimize your Eden emulator so you can play without any glitches or lag. Don't worry, I'll walk you through every setting, and you can pause the video at each step if you need to. We want smooth, smooth gameplay, like Mario gliding on the ice in Mario Kart. Follow the settings and you'll be ready for action. Now a quick disclaimer, I won't be able to show gameplay of Metroid Prime 4, beyond because Nintendo's a little strict with Switch emulation right now, think Bowser level strict. So no gameplay footage here, but don't worry, if you follow the steps I've shown you, you'll be able to play it on your PC in no time. If this guide helped you out, please give the video a thumbs up, hit the notification bell, and subscribe to my channel. It's like unlocking a secret character, every sub helps me out big time. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Until then, happy gaming and may the power of the Triforce be with you.